Encouraging an appetite for reading to grade 9 students at Parkside School, Marty Chen shared his journey as an author. Chen has published five chapter novels, one picture book, and has written over 30 plays. He was at the Redcliffe School as part of the Word Power Tour. She is brought to the southern region of Alberta by uh, the Young Alberta Book Society and Synovus Energy. Uh, there are eight authors touring uh, communities in southern Alberta, sort of in sparking a love of uh, reading and writing in students uh, in various schools. He says when he goes into schools, he likes to share the inspiration behind his books and plays. Just to give them a, a sense of behind the scenes, that a story doesn't arrive fully formed, that there's actually a seed of inspiration that, that can come from not movies or other books, but from your own life. And if you pay attention closely enough, uh, you can find any spark for a story. He says a lot of his inspiration comes from his childhood. I grew up in a small town called Morinville in Alberta, just north of Edmonton. And uh, as the only Chinese kid at school, I never felt like I, I fit in. And I wanted to sort of capture that experience for kids so that anybody who doesn't feel like they belong to a community, they realize that this is something that everyone goes through at some point. And it doesn't matter if it's because of a cultural difference. It could be the fact that you wear glasses and nobody else does. Chan says one of the things he wants to ignite is the importance of literacy. And uh, it's really important to get kids at an early age to love books and to keep reading. And if they develop that, that sort of passion for reading at an early age, it can become a lifelong habit. And uh, that's one of the big reasons why uh, Synovus and Young Alberta Book Society wanted to put this tour together. For more information about the Word Power Tour, you can visit the Young Alberta Book Society's website at www.yabs.ab.ca. For Shaw TV, I'm Leanne Evans.